its calf. Springers are cows or heifers that are close to giving birth. It's very important they are checked regularly to see if any are having problems calving. When you're checking the springers, do it quietly, so as not to disturb or stress them and be thorough. Take your time and make sure you check all areas for newborn calves. Calves can hide in drains, hollows, hedges and long grasses. If you see any cow or heifer that has started to show signs of calving, record her number so you can monitor her progress. When you're working near cows and calves, remember to stay safe and not turn your back on newly calved cows. Even cows that are usually calm can become aggressive after calving, so it's important to keep the calf between you and its mother. It is important to observe and check calves as soon after birth as possible to identify any problems. If you're nearby shortly after the birth of a calf, check to make sure the calf is breathing. Look to see if the calf's chest is rising and falling, if there are bubbles forming around its nose or if it's sneezing. If a calf isn't breathing, you can help it breathe by clearing mucus from its nose and mouth or roughly rubbing its chest and sides with a towel, a handful of grass or your hand. Once you're sure the calf is breathing, check it over to make sure it is normal and healthy and record the birth. Make sure you know what, how and where you are expected to record births on your farm. Typical things you may be expected to record are the date, the sex of the calf. Is it a bull or a heifer? You can check the sex of the calf by lifting its leg or tail. If the calf has two holes and teats, it is a heifer. If the calf only has one hole and a bull sack, it's a bull. The mother's tag number. The calf identity or number. You can use neck bands with numbered tags to temporarily identify newborn calves in the paddock. If the calf is alive or dead, if the calving was assisted or unassisted. After you've recorded information about the cow and calf, spray or dip the calf's navel with iodine so it is completely covered. By doing this, you will help protect the calf from getting sick. Before the calving season starts, talk with your boss and the rest of the team to make sure that you know how to safely check springers and newborn calves and how to record births on your farm. This will help reduce the risk of calving issues and provide the best start for calves along with getting you home on time after a big day. Remember to check springers regularly and quietly. Stay safe, keep the calf between you and its mother. Record details of the birth.